Sadiq, you guys jumped on early and got to a 12 point lead, pretty much led throughout uh, up until uh, midway through the fourth quarter. How frustrating maybe is it to not be able to salt this one away at the end? Yeah, it's tough, man. We don't like to, we don't like to lose at all. Uh, I feel like we were controlling the game most of the game. Uh, we had a key, couple of key defensive lapses, and then we couldn't cover on the other end. So uh, it was a credit to them. But, you know, like you said, it's tough. It's tough not to win that. How much of a gut check game was this for you guys, knowing that you, know, you're, you were the only guy playing from the opening night starting five uh, and trying to replicate that type of production, which I know next man up is next man up, but uh, you know, how much of a gut check was it like, hey, guys, let's see what we can do with that? Yeah, yeah for sure. I mean, I think it's been like that all week. Uh, you know, guys have been out, but, um, but like you said, I think everybody, uh, you know, saw that, you know, we just needed next man up, and I think everybody that came on the floor contributed, so uh, it's got to be a little bit better, more disciplined, uh, but everybody, you know, came in and contributed, so um, it was good to see. I know how important it is for you individually to be out there every night. Tried to give it a go in Sacramento, obviously. Uh, you go, you know, four inactives, now you get a chance to come back. How tough was it for you to be home watching and how yeah. grateful to be back out. Yeah, it's a well. First, it's a blessing from God that I'll be able to, to play uh, right now. Uh, but like, it was tough, man. I, I really wanted to play in sack, uh, but you know the medical staff did it. You know, had you know made a tough decision. It was you know for my best interest in the, in the, in the future. Uh, but you know it was good watching those games. You know I think you know they had a two good games in Denver and Utah and one and then almost one in Phoenix. So it was just great to see. Um, you know, the team played well. Uh, but, you know, it was definitely tough seeing that from, you know, back home. We haven't really show, seen you show much, like, pain. And the last time we saw you, you looked like you, you were going through it. Did, are you surprised that the injury didn't hold you out? Did you think it was worse when it happened? Um, I mean, when it first happened, I, I, it was – I didn't even want to see the uh, the replay of it. But uh, that initial pain was – it was tough. But after that, I was like, you know, I'm just going to try to, you know, do whatever it takes to play the next day. Uh, so I just mentally, I was like, you know, it's not gonna, I'm not going to let it bother me. And like you mentioned, there were a few possessions at the end that, that kind of led to the Cavs winning this one. But you guys also missed 12 free throws. And that's happened a couple of times throughout the season. How do you rectify that? Is that something that's been discussed with you guys, just the free throw shooting this season? Yeah, for sure. I mean, um, like you said, we put, us, put ourselves in a position to win. You know, if we make over half of those free throws, it could be different, different ball game, like you said. So I think it's just us getting back in the gym and, like, you even coach said it during the, after the game, just get back in the gym and, and really focus on that because we need those down the stretch.